Look at now we look like a billboard. <laughs> hey, we are cooking for a good cause today. Celebrity chef Amanda Freitag from Food Network's Chopped and Cooking channels, Unique Eats, is here to tell us about Share and an organization that helps women fighting breast cancer and ovarian cancer. That's right. Yes. Um, we're having a huge fundraiser. It's our ninth annual. It's called the Second Helping of Life, which uh -huh. is a great Perfect. title. And Share helps women in support. Mm -hmm. they, if they need to call somebody, if they need to talk to somebody, they can pick up the phone 24 hours a day. It's all free. And that's exactly what women need when they're going through that. They just need to talk to somebody else who's been through it. Right. So it's 30 female chefs, me, of course, yes. and then Missy Robbins from Avoce, Alex Gornichelli, all your favorite females under one roof cooking for you. I Supporting love that. everybody. Supporting, yeah. supporting each other. So, so what are we together. making this morning? So Amanda? I want you guys to help me. Okay. I'm making something healthy but delicious at the same time. You can't get anybody good unless it tastes good. Okay. All right. So I'm going to do the heat. You guys do this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so they first, won't let me near the fryer. <laughs> this is your so. time. Okay. <laughs> what we're doing first is roasting these gorgeous plums. So I'm okay. going to put them in. They're going to sear a little. And that's and you an just olive have oil? Butter, olive yeah, oil. Yeah, I just have olive oil. I use olive oil all the time and it's so good for you. Mm -hmm. I mean it's so good for your cholesterol. It just has antioxidants. It has everything you need. So you're just going to sear that. Okay. But as John was saying earlier, the weather's still good so yeah. you could use your grill. Okay. So these yep. could also go on the grill but if it's too cold. And you just brush them with olive oil them in then. the pan. Yep. Okay. And then so, yeah. they come out this golden color. So you leave them and then you're going to flip it for me. Flip okay. It. And then what we've done over here, we started to marinate this gorgeous kale. Okay. Lemon, olive oil, it wilts a little bit. There's some shallow which I put also lemon in, mm -hmm. not raw. Okay. I know, you know, we talked about our chopped judges. Some of them don't like raw onion because it leaves that flavor in your mouth. Sure. The best way to do it without cooking is marinate them. Mm -hmm. Oh, so lemon. marinate it just in lemon. Yeah. Well, the oh, lemon will and they cook it. Cook yeah. and break down. Again, lemon. Kale, plums. This is all very it's healthy. It's very really good for and you. And kale is like the new wonder food. I eat it every day. Every she said really? she loves yeah. it. <laughs> I do. Wow. It's very healthy. You saute it. You, you do tons of stuff yeah, with saute kale. It, and excited to use it, it um, just completely raw, which yeah. you don't hear of often. Raw is amazing. It's all the rage. So if you guys could put together these crostinis well, By the me. way, I'd never heard the word crostini. Crostini just means crouton in Italian. Oh, okay. So you she just normally like, bake it so it's yeah. crispy. Yeah. You bake it so it's crispy. Language and then on the show as well. A little chef tip is yes. that when you make toast or croutons or anything mm -hmm. like this, put olive oil and put salt. Oh, okay. Uh, you know, you go to the restaurant, you're like, God, well, how do the chefs really do it? How do they so make it taste so good? Just brush it with olive oil, oil, with olive oil, oil and, and then and like the salt. salt. Okay, yes. I have to ask you a question, Amanda. Yes. What, what if I am watching my carb intake? Is there an alternative to bread? Yeah, absolutely. You could do this on, you know, maybe a piece of grilled zucchini. Oh, or you yeah. could how make just a little. Be? You could make just a little salad. Exactly. Ooh, yeah. That's the nice. other yes. alternative. Yeah. And mm -hmm. I can show you how to do that. And you can take that delicious ricotta, mm -hmm. put a scoop of it on here. For I will me. do that for you right now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Here's that skill. <laughs> yeah. And this is something I would serve, you know, to a guest as a first course. This just looks so Look fresh. Look at that. I mean, that a looks lovely. beautiful salad. And then these plums. I mean, this time of year, you have everything mm -hmm. so in I the put market. This on top of here? Yeah. Then you okay. put a little bit oh. of that on top. Okay. And then you're going to top it with a little piece of the plum. Okay. And how long do we need to let these rest? Just a there. little bit on each side already. until they get soft. Mm -hmm. Can I try this? Please. Oh, eat oh it. it's great. I have some prepared so here good. that have softened a little bit. Mm. I mean, so good. It's great Here's the other thing. If you love eating it while you're cooking it, you're going to love the finished product. Mm -hmm. So taste as you go. Mm. I highly encourage tasting as you go. All right, I'm going to stop cooking and I'm so going to taste. <laughs> taste. Mm. Yeah, and then as That's a salad, so it's really good too. <laughs> now it's this, less messy. Are these all in season, like the plums yes. and the kale plums, and everything? Kale. Mm -hmm. Everything's coming out of the ground right now, and you you have summer mm -hmm. ending with all oh, the so eggplant good. tomatoes, and mm -hmm. then you have winter starting so with good. these great winter greens, and then plums are going to leave us soon. So get them while you can. No, finally, I do have to ask you: How did you get involved with uh, Share? How did you? I, was asked to do the event many, many years ago um, by another female chef friend, and I just, I said yes, and then I was in awe of what they were doing. So every year, somehow, some way, I try to participate. Oh, thank you so much. Thank chef you Amanda for Amanda Freitag. Me. The Share event is at Chelsea Piers on September 24th. Yes. You can get tickets and more info at sharecancersupport.org, and we'll also put that information up at WLMYTV.com. And Amanda, and you so look so sweet fancy too. to stick around. She was on our CBS yeah. show earlier.
here this morning. You've been yep. here all morning. Yeah, Thanks you know. so much. Thank you, so Thank you for feeding us. Uh, yeah. you. Delicious. Thank Delicious. you. Delicious. You guys at home have got to try this. Now, we obviously, just like every day, covered a lot today. And here are the three things we learned. Most people know when a relationship is over. They just can't put it in words. So try writing down what you want to say during a breakup. Mm -hmm. Have you heard about this? And don't this? text it. Don't. Have you heard about this, Amanda? Don't text. Sake right. is like wine. <laughs> <laughs> He's had a couple of glasses. Different types go with different meals and occasions. Some are served on ice, others at room temperature. Ooh. Do your homework and see which one you like. Do you have a favorite sake? I like the cloudy, milky kind. Oh, I like that, yeah. too. See? Yeah, it's like a, per like, yeah, very, yeah. very good. I'm very trying them all. You, know, you can always call she me. She obviously knows her stuff. <laughs> And I learned that a simple crostini can be a delicious appetizer. Yeah. All you have to do is just pick the natural ingredients and find a famous chef to help you out. That's right. <laughs> Amanda, thank you so much. You can also check out the share event on September 24th. Right. Don't forget about that. So Which that, sounds awesome. Yeah. And you can look so fancy with your friends. That's like what this. I said. And it's very I easy to do. I can make this. Can and I'm impress. really a good cook. So. You can impress. <laughs> Amanda, thank you so much for being thank here. You. Thank you. That just about does it for us today. We're going to keep eating. Thanks so much. <laughs> we had a usual. great time. Yeah, we eat all the time. Yeah. We'll be right back here eating again tomorrow, I'm sure. We'll see you guys at 7. Oh, yeah. Have an awesome day. Yeah, we're going to have a great show tomorrow, too. Probably yep. shouldn't drink as much, though. No. <laughs> no. Why not? Uh, really? really. This is why we're not